As this level begins, we find ourselves at the seaside, which is odd as we just walked into a castle in the woods. But there's no time for confusion, we're going to quickly grab ourselves a Blast Ola Cola and move on. As you can see, we have some new enemies this time, replacing the birds with bug eyes and fireballs. Presumably, the fireball is some kind of life form, but how it works is a mystery. You'll also have noticed that our second Blast Ola Cola can has upgraded our fireball, and so now it's almost useful. And here I managed to get a shield without taking any damage, so I'm rewarded with an extra life, bringing me up to the maximum of five. The bug eyes behave differently to the birds, jumping rather than flying, and can actually fall off the gaps between platforms the same as you can. The fireballs, however, are essentially brave birds, they just look different. I find the bug eyes are actually easier to deal with than fireballs, brave birds, or shy birds, simply because they're easier to hit, especially with our upgraded weapon, but it's not a big change. For the rest, this level is mostly some simple platforming, a bit of a change of scene from the last one, but nothing much to surprise or challenge you. That's about to change though, as we end this level by grabbing our third Blast Ola Cola and boarding a rocket. That's right, we've hardly arrived and we're already leaving Tambi. Join me next time as we tour the moon.